relationship between the times, since a ball was thrown at its height, can be modeled by the equation h is equal to 32 t minus 16 t squared plus 4, where h is the height of the ball after t seconds. Complete the square to find how long it will take the ball to reach a height of 20 feet. In this equation here, first of all, we are we are looking at the equation. What we have, well, h is equal to 32 t minus 16 t squared plus 4. To, and then we look at what height. It says that 20 feet high, how many seconds is going to reach? So instead of the equation h here, we are going to plug in a 20. And the rest of the equation, in the right side, we are writing in the way how it is. is 32 feet, 32 t, minus 16 t squared. And the last constant is uh, 4, plus 4. Before we go any further, we have, we should uh, subtract here by minus 4, all the equation. In, I am subtracting this equation by minus 4. I am going to get here uh, 20 minus 4 is uh, 16, which is equal. And another side is a 32t minus 32t minus 16t uh, square. And as I see here, the whole equation is a divisible by 16. Because it's divisible by 16, I'm going to divide this equation with a 16. But because the minus 16t squared in the front of the t square is a negative sign and I want this to make a positive, I'm going everything to divide by minus 16. And if I divide everything by minus 16, this equation is going to look this way. Uh, minus 16 by minus 16 here is a just a t square. So I'm just let me put here in the I'm going to switch other sides of the equation. Whatever is on the right, I'm going to put on the left. Whatever is on the left, I'm going to put on the right side. So because I'm dividing minus, uh, minus 16t squared by minus 16 is just a t squared. And now 32t divided by minus 16 is a minus 2t. And in the other side, I have a 16 divided by minus 16 is a minus 1. So b here is a 2 divided by 2 because I want this to convert into the complete in the square is equal to 1. And 1 square is equal to 1. And now I want here to add 1 square in a whole equation, but 1 square is 1. I am adding everything in this equation, and what I'm going to get here is a t square minus 2t plus 1. Plus 1, and in the other side I'm going to get minus 1 plus 1, which is 0. So this side is equal to 0. And in the other side, now this is a perfect uh, trinomial squared, and this I can convert into the into the binomial square, which is a t. Because the sign here is negative, I can write here negative one, and everything here square. And if I'm solving this uh, equation for t, it's going to have a just a uh, two solutions is going to be equal with one solution with one. So I am I am writing as a single solution one. And what I what is clear here, when the ball is going to reach a 20 feet, the time is going to be one second. So for one second, the ball is going to reach to reach uh, 20 feet. So this is the equation for this example.